to uh, the deep sewers, so I showed you one way, which is uh, going down and breaking those rocks through Cobalt Chasm. So the other way, one of the other ways, is to go through uh, the Knoll area. So this is the center of town of Ascension, so this is uh, the Rowan's Guardian. This is if you port into town, this is where you end up. So up here we're going to go to north of town. This way is a little trickier um, because it's really, the beholders are kind of nasty and it's really best to have an item with mind and uh, also death magic immunity because the beholders will kill you. Uh, the level of that area is actually capped at 25, although you can do it at maybe 12 or so if you're doing pretty well. Oh, got a bunch of hyenas in front of me. That did not work very well. Mostly because their models are just big. I'm just gonna run by these guys. As I am level 62, which I am way too high level for this, but just for demonstration purposes. You'd probably want to do this around level 15-ish. So here we are, this is the Knoll Fort. This, these are the front doors. You can't really get in that way very well. You can, but it's tricky. So you walk around to the side, over here, and you're looking for a little spot of vines that come down. There we go, and there's a little teeny tiny, not very obvious transition right there. So we just go in there, and you can go under the Knoll Fort. So now we're underneath the fort. It's called Knoll Quarters. Interest of time, I'm gonna run past a lot of these guys. These guys don't wanna let me past. Okay, so I need to, again, I need some loot breakers, although you can't actually bash these, so if you have a weapon, it's less difficult. But I'm a druid, so I can just break things. So there are some traps here. Divine traps. They don't do much to me at this level. Now this is actually locked. But what unlocks it is not the Knoll Fort key, it's actually this thing. It's actually the Seal Breaker. Which is confusing, and actually took me a while to figure out. These guys are all coming up and bothering me. So I used a key, and that was the Seal Breaker. And I also need the Seal Breaker right here. These guys are coming up. So whenever you see this arcane seal, Say try to break the seal, and you climb in. So now we're in the Beholder Prison. So this is a really great area for XP. Kind of when you're in the teens. Problem is, Beholders are kinda bad. It's also a great place to get loot. There's not very many loot spots, but they seem to uh, pop a lot of useful loot. Here. These are really nasty at about level 10. 10 to even 20. Uh, but at my level, it's not too big of a deal. So we come up here. And this is the sort of boss of this area the Elder Orb. So it says have to be 24 or lower to earn this accomplishment, so I can't get it because this is actually a new design area. So you notice that a little dialogue cops pops up from this invisible object. 
So it says, the fumes billowing in up into the center of the room are floating up through a small drain pipe. The sides are very slick. You believe you could fit into the opening. If you enter, there will be no way for you to climb back up. Do you wish to enter the hole? And the answer is yes. This will take us down to the deep sewers. So we say yes. And voila! We're at the exact spot um, where we left off before. So this is another way you can get to the deep sewers. And again, uh, if you wander around over to here, you can get the rat chewed corpse, you get uh, the strange ward stone, and you can go back and forth. So that's method number two to get here. Method number three is a little more complicated. So I'm going to pause for a second. I got to grab at least one item 